hey, welcome to my channel and just stick around and watch as I install this Lockley Secure Plus Dead Bloat in matte black. Uh, so my previous lock was a Schlage sensor lock, which you see here, and um, it involves just really removing screws, but I ran into a strip screw issue. Previ the previous installer left a strip screw, which I despise, um, but thankfully I had a you see it here. Thankfully I had a strip screw extractor set. And the key with using these is you start with the first unit. If that one doesn't work, you move up to the second, then to the third, et cetera, et cetera, till you find one that works. Um, so got everything off. All the rest of the screws were perfect in reversing. Um, funny thing is when I got to the front, I had to hammer that off. It was so securely attached um, with adhesive. So anyway, Everything is good. Now I'm ready to install the Lockley lock. Um, of course, all the instructions you need are included in the box. Here I'm screwing in the deadbolt. And next I will start with the outside portion of the assembly. It's secured with adhesive, but they do offer hardware if you want to drill an extra hole, which I didn't think was necessary. Now I'm using, moving rather, to the inside assembly. And again, that's going to be secured with adhesive also after you establish level, um, which you see me doing here. So after level is established, pull off the adhesive tab, stick everything in, and go ahead and um, screw it in. Here I am finger tightening and screwing the inside assembly to the outside assembly. And next it will be time to start um, connecting the communication cable uh, right after I test to see if the keys are working, which they are. The deadbolt is moving smoothly. So here, like I said, I'm going to start uh, working on the communication cable. And it offered me a little bit of challenge because the area, the pieces are small, the area is constricted, and I was just being really careful that I didn't damage anything. Um, so after that's all done, yeah, it was just a little bit challenging. But after all that's done, it's time to close the whole unit. And that is done by screws, of course. Um, so once the last battery is installed, you hold the program button and the lock performs its very own self check. It checks to see if it's a left closing or a right closing door. Um, it has you swipe and touch to make sure everything is working properly. And there you have it. You see the lights flashing. The Lockley lock is installed successfully, but I could not, um, you know, let this beautiful lock sit on top of a regular doorknob. So here you see I'm starting to remove the old doorknob and get ready to install a brand new matte black handle. Now, this handle is requiring me to drill a bottom stabilizing hole. So I'm starting off with a small drill bit, moving up incrementally so that I don't drill too big of a hole. And Installing doorknobs is really easy, um, especially if you're replacing doorknobs. Now, I've never so far had to do it in a door where the hole wasn't already pre-drilled, but otherwise, um, putting in a new doorknob is a quick and easy I fit. got the Lockley Secure Plus Deadbolt all installed, and let's go over a few of its features. So here, if you want to just go the old fashioned route, you can insert the key that comes with the package. Um, otherwise, you just click the keypad and these numbers randomly um, alternate. And you'd put in your six to eight digit code and press the OK button to lock it. I like that feature. You also have the fingerprint mode. Um, so yeah, also it locks automatically after a certain amount of time that you can set up in your app. Right now I have my
I'd set up for, I think, either 30 seconds or one minute. It'll automatically lock. Let's say I'm coming in with groceries. I can uh, not be concerned with locking the door behind me. It'll lock automatically. Um, what else? Oh, fingerprint. So let me put in my fingerprint here. And you see it unlocked. Um, so I like this lock because it offers, like I said, the random um, digits. You can set it for, ran for it to randomly cycle these digits. You can also set it so that the digits stay fixated. Um, but otherwise it's working well. I, you know, you can lock the door from the app for this model also. Um, so yeah. Just the installation was really easy. The hardest part about installing this lock actually was just getting the old lock off. Um, but this lock installation took me maybe 30 minutes. And that's because I was being extra careful. Um, so anyone can do it. Get yourself a Lockley deadbolt.